Hello guys. Alright. I call this my box journal set. Don't ask me why I just started making journals for a design project for Melody Made and her cat kit and ended up, I don't know, I just went down a rabbit hole. I don't know what I ended up at and what, but to give you an idea, I just took, this is a pop box, soda box, depending on what part of the country you're in, and used some of my quilted pieces that I had and quilt pieces and different things and lace and just sort of put it together. Used some crochet pieces and made four journals. Yeah, you heard me. Four journals. So, I do not remember what's all in these. I don't even remember what top and bottom is on these. So, let's just sort of start going through them. They're very simple. That's just a little made for writing and whatnot. Fabric pockets. Used a frame as a belly band and tucks. You can see here her uh, pet cat, perfect, perfect something. Oh, I can't remember the name. I should have looked it up first. No matter, I would have still forgotten. I'm horrible with my memory. Just a lot of using leftover things. So that's what inspired me. Because I went down my rabbit hole. And it was actually, ended up being one of these journals. It might be this one. I don't know. That ended up being a Dear Julie Julie challenge. And I used some little extra pieces. So we'll see which one was the complete all Melody Made stuff. Um, I even pulled out some old digitals and things that I got from years ago from uh, Melody's uh, Patreon. That's a napkin. But we will see here. Just different things. All kinds of things. It's a little booklet. I just ended up sort of went through and just the colors. That's fabric, of course. You can tell that, can't you, Boutique? It's a Melody Made tag. Fabric flip. It's from her kit. That's an accordion folder. Our kit. Lace pocket. And some things tucked in there. Um, I don't know where I got those. I find so many things all over the place. I try to source things for free. Used a card. That's a ticket for Melody's kit. Guest check. Something tells me this is part of a Dear Julie Julie challenge with all these guest checks and stuff or things left over from one. Wallpaper. From Melody's kit. Double tuck. Melody's kit, that print right there. A little hold out for journaling. Another one of her tags from her kit. Some slow stitching that I had done. Some more slow stitching that I had done. Little cluster thingies I made. And I even put one on the back. Or something at one time or the other. I don't know. Very similar, all the papers are coordinating. 
might help I turn it correctly. Lace ruffle. Lynch card. Um, use, these are some cutouts from the stamp set. Some dyed papers. The double tuck. Those are some uh, for melodies. Tickets and tags. I believe these are, yep, these are tags from Melody's. MelodyMade.com. Contact her. She has a YouTube channel and contact her, and you can get any of her digital. She has uh, a few. Another one of her pages. These are uh, insides of a die cut. So I used them sort of. There's a little notebook. Like with scrapbooking paper, lace pocket. Just different things. Different things. You've seen binding. On the edges, it's from Melodies. It prints from Melodies as well. Seeing a few Dear Julie Julie uh, digitals. This is from Old Cre Old Creative Memory stuff from a long time ago when I was a consultant. That's from Melodies right there. That's some of my uh, dyed papers. Creative Memory stuff. Some of my slow stitching and cluster, favorite clusters I've done. Some melodies. Made a little note, uh, notebook tag. You forget. Even if it's been a couple months, you go back and you're like, oh, I made that. These are from melodies. Another little fold out tag to write in. Planner pages. That's from Melody's Kid as well. Pockets. I put pockets in the journal so you can stuff stuff in. Melody's kit. I don't know where those came from. Stuff I'd found. Had cats on them. Melody's kit. That's from a greeting card. Christmas card. That I cut it out. That too came from the same card. From Melody's kit. She's in a frame. Cut off that's supposed to be thrown away. I just thought that neat little place to do some writing. This is a vintage card, vintage greeting card. I found a tuck in there and a little belly bin from a creative memories thing. That is, I don't know, it's just a print. I think it's from a children's book actually. It's from Melody's kit. It's from Melody's kit. Another card, and add lovable, and some of the Dear Julie Julie. Made a stamp out of some Dear Julie Julie on some uh, dyed paper. Just sort of different things. Use, this is from clothing. Old clothing, in fact. Some lace from old clothing. I use it as a trim. These are very simple. Just make them scrapbook paper. You don't have to have wallpaper. You don't have to have cardboard. That's from Melody's kit. It's from Melody's kit. And something free I found. Something free I found. Simple from car uh, scrapbooking paper. Tied a little fuzzy yarn on there as a tab. This is pretty plain. Pretty much, you know, just add your own stuff in, write. Couple more of those little cat ATC type cards. That's from a magazine. Put it on some uh, cereal box, I think, or some food box cardboard. That's from Melody. It's another ATC cat card. Paper I dyed, played with. Waterfall. It's 
these uh, little tags I found free. This vintage uh, book or something that uh, those came from. The, it's copied from a vintage book that somebody had shared. And just a lot of places for you to come back in and add more to. I had space in the box. I had to throw something together at the last minute with things I had left over. I'm sure this is what this one is. Tried to get a lot of different, uh, wanted to use a lot of different yarns and colors as melodies. Of course, all that scrapbook and paper. Okay. This one, I think, is mostly Melody stuff. Is this one. This was the original journal I did. I came up with the box idea and wanted to do it. Um, some vintage pom-poms from a curtain, cut off lace, piece of scrapbooking paper, and I just sort of cut them off. And it's a pom-pom yarn. It was vintage. Those are from... Um, oh, actually, those are free Google search silhouettes of cats I found. It mimicked a lot of the stuff she did and wanted to add some things in there. Tag, a skinny tag, you know, you can write in. Fabric pocket, did some stamping. Fabric pocket, lace pocket, or tab, I've got some lace up there. Melodies. This might have been the one I did. Using her stuff. Using some digitals. I think those are from Dear Jolly Jolly Digitals. Flower made ruffle. Meow. It's up there, a little fabric flip. Melodies. On a guest check. Paper I dyed, just made a flip up, flip down. Magazine. It was origami paper. Somebody had folded it up, and I didn't want to throw it away, so I unfolded it and used it as a backing on a tag. It's from Melody Skid. I had some scrapbooking paper on there. Melody's kit, right there. Some of the dyed paper I did, creative memory stuff. Fabric belly band. Seeing some uh, Dear Julie Julie stuff popping up. That's with the little roses and the and vintage antique. I want to, it's sort of combined, because, you know, that's vintage fabric right there. Just combine sort of the vintage with the modern. So it'll come up. That's from Melody Skit right there. Large tag. Just use calendar and bits of the pieces from the calendar to make lines and stuff on it. Belly band with fabric. And a little fabric flip actually on the belly band. That's an old Melody made thing from Patreon. Using Dear Julie Julie Digitals there. It's her Daisy Echo Dying and date one of her Daisy kits. I've got on every one of Dear Julie Julie's kits. And so I'll be honest, it's a scrap from Melody's. Fiji. It's from Melody's with uh, creative memories on the side. And so I'll be honest, I couldn't tell you what digits, what or what. I love cats. I believe that's from Melody's. Teeny tiny thing there. Uh, ultra playing card. Daisy thing. So I just sort of mix and match things together. So I couldn't tell you what kits are what and who comes from what most of the time. I mean, I couldn't tell you specific kits. I pretty much can tell you who they came from. That's a flip down. You can do some additional writing. That's a napkin. That's from uh, Melody's. This is with the washi tape there. I happen to have. Don't know where I picked it up at. Buy things cheap, and I get them just in case. 
So most of my things are free or very, very cheap. Fabric stacked pockets here. And got some vintage lace that I have added to the edges. And there we go. Look there. I love those crocheted roses. No, I did not make them. Some vintage things that I sourced somewhere. I have spilled stuff in here. I let things set up and they just sort of didn't. I knew I hadn't done a video on these yet, so I had not packed them up yet. Well, there you go. Thank you.